two, grammar. Today we have conditional sentences with future will. Let's begin by knowing the future will. I will give you an example of a sentence using future will. Positive. I will buy you PlayStation 4. Now, I can use future will for promises like, for example, like this sentence, I am making you a promise. I will buy you PlayStation 4. I can use it for predictions, like, for example, when I predict that it will rain today, I say it will rain today because we have dark clouds in the sky. I can use it for on-the-spot decisions. Like when I make a decision, I can say that I will become a teacher when I grow up. I can use it to make offers, like I will help you with your homework tonight. I can use it when I make a request, like will you help me please with my homework? Now, let's see how we can turn this positive well sentence into negative easy all what we will do is just add not to well I will not buy you or I can also say I won't buy you PlayStation 4 that's the same thing won't is the same as will not so it should be easy to make negative sentences how about yes no questions yeah all what we will do is begin our question with will and then put the subject pronoun will you or will I will he buy me PlayStation 4 it's a question how do we answer this yes I will or no I won't no I will not okay now we understand what the future will is now let's move on to conditional sentences what are these now I will connect or combine my future will sentence with a condition. I will buy you PlayStation 4 if you do well in school. Now I'm using the same exact sentence I used before. But now I have a condition. If you do well in school, this is the condition. I will buy you PlayStation 4. This is what we call the F clause. If you do well in school, I will buy you PlayStation 4. This is one sentence from the I here until number 4 here. This is one sentence. But inside this sentence, we have two clauses. This is the if clause, and this is the main clause. This is the, main, the most important part. I will buy you PlayStation 4. Notice that in this close this part I'm using present simple while in here I'm using future will this future will future will I'm using it here what is present simple if you forgot about present simple I suggest that you go back and watch full blast 5 1 a 2 video because in that video I go in deep with the present simple as a quick reminder in present simple we don't add ing to the verb we don't add anything we use it as it is in the basic form we use present simple for things that happen in general we add s to the verb if the subject is he she or it if he eats his food i will take him out with me this is how i say it if he eats if you eat if i eat if they eat if he eats if she eats, if he does, if she does, if it does, he, she, it, we add is to the verb. This is just a quick reminder. Okay? Now let's move on. Look, does it matter if I begin the sentence with the if close or the main close? No. If I want, I can start my sentence with the main clause. I will buy you PlayStation 4 if you do well in school no changes are made this will give the exact meaning all I did was 
switch between the if clause and the main clause one small thing I did I removed the comma if you begin your sentence with the conditional if clause or the time clause you need a comma if you begin with the main clause you don't put the comma this right here is called comma now let's move on to time clauses in time clauses you use after before when until as soon as or unless instead of using if you can use if if you want if you don't want to use if you can use one of these time clauses like when I say when you do well in school I will buy you PlayStation 4 see I just copied the same thing instead of using if I used when this is the time close the same thing I'm still using present simple and I'm using future will with the main clause now I used when I can use after for example I I can say I will buy you PlayStation 4 after the final exams or I can use before I will buy you PlayStation 4 before the vacation starts I can use until I will stay home with you until it's 12 a.m. I can use as soon as I will buy you PlayStation 4 as soon as I have the money because I don't have it at the moment as soon as I have the money I will buy you PlayStation 4 I can use unless like I will say I will not buy you PlayStation 4 unless you do well in school it gives the same meaning but instead of using positive main clause I used negative main clause I will not buy you PlayStation 4 unless you do well in school that means you need to do well in school for me to get you PlayStation 4 I hope that this is very clear now let's work on the exercise on page 23 match the two halves of the sentences you can eat some cheese after I try them on when you try something on that that has something to do with clothes right like you are buying new pajamas you need to try them on try them on for clothes not for food he is telling you to eat some cheese I won't speak to him again tell him to wait for me as soon as he arrives at the airport he'll get very angry if you get hungry if it doesn't rain of course hungry eat hungry that makes sense you eat cheese if you are hungry Ted will call us okay when will he call us once he arrives at the airport as soon as means once means the minute he gets to the airport he will make that call three I'll make up my mind means I'll make I will decide I will choose which shirt to buy after I try them on try them on means just check them see if they fit me if they don't fit me if they are very small if they are very large for me Four. we might go mountain biking on Saturday oh this has something to do with the rain yeah if it doesn't rain if there is no rain we will go mountain biking that means we will drive our bikes on the mountain five unless Larry says sorry I will not speak to him again that's it we're through we're done he's a bad friend he has to say I'm sorry for me to speak to him again six when Kevin sees this mess mess means things are not organized for example you go to Kevin's room and you make it messy how will Kevin feel when he sees the mess you made he will get very angry 
if Oliver comes round, comes round means visit. If Oliver visits, see, tell him to wait for me because I'm coming. I won't, I won't be late. I hope that you learned something today. If you like this video, please share it with friends. Goodbye and take care.